Hey guys, Chinese New Year is coming and as an Asian, we get a bunch of red packets aka Ang Pao's which means I'll finally have the budget to build another keyboard. So without further ado, let's get right into building a Chinese New Year team keyboard. Starting off with the base kit, we have the CM64 keyboard kit. We are greeted with a set of plate mounted stabilizers following with a plastic case. The CM64 PCB which I tape modeled it off camera, plate foam, and plate. It also came with screws for the PCB and rubber feet which I forgot to include in the clip. Let's start off by modding the stabilizers just like that. These stabilizers came pre looped so I had to wash and dry them before holly modding and lubing. These stabilizers are actually really bad in my opinion but I managed to make it sound better after a few days of tuning. I really wish that they would stick to the clip-in stabilizers because those are so much better and easier to mod. After that, we'll be screwing the PCB onto the case. I also placed two layers of foam afterwards to make it sound less hollow. Then we could go ahead and place the plate foam along with the plate. Next up, we have our switches that we'll be using for today's build which are the KTT Wine Reds. These are linear switches which are supposed to be rivals to Gatoran Yellows but I still think that Gatoran Yellows are better. However, these switches are really cheap so you'll be getting what you paid for. I looped the housing and stem with Crytox 205G0 and tried back lubing the springs with 105G0 which definitely saved a lot of time. After a few hours of lubing, we can finally install all the switches onto the PCB. With all the switches installed, we can move on to the final part which is also the part that makes this keyboard a Chinese New Year team keyboard. These keycaps are called Space Explorer Team Keycaps which doesn't look like a space team at all and two things I noticed after unboxing is that I bought the wrong profile keycaps and the letters look so bold. But other than that, the color looks super attractive and the picture keys definitely match the Chinese New Year team. So overall this keyboard looks and sound pretty good except for the stabilizers but I tried my best modding them. 
This keyboard kit is a really good budget kit to start with if you're new to the custom keyboard community and I would definitely recommend this. As for the switches, I love the feel as it is very similar with Gatoran yellows and after lubing them it feels pretty good as well. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoy this video and by the time this video comes out, it's already Chinese New Year. So happy Chinese New Year and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.